my phone to get my what's my problem I don't go alone and get it how I want it I don't be alone to figure out how I should be loved And if it's just us, is that enough? Is it bad that I want more? Is it too late for us? We go dangerous, moving so close we come back Hey y'all, today is Tuesday. Um, last week, or not even last week, on Sunday, Jamima and I went to go get our ears pierced and I think I have an ear infection. Like my lymph, my neck is swollen. I know, I know, I barely have any neck to begin with, but my neck is swollen and I'm having like pain all right here. And like it, it hurts just on this side when I swallow. So, um, I mean, I can definitely, I can feel it. I can feel it so I know it's there. Um, I tried to go to the emergency room in urgent care, but they're charging things that don't make sense. Like health, I don't even wanna get into it cause it's gonna make me very, very upset. But I went to this place called Care Now and he was like, I have to pay a deductible of $180. I said, I can't even be seen if I don't have $180. He said, no, I just walked out. I think that's so disrespectful. And then I have insurance and you still want me to pay 180? What am I paying insurance for? What am I paying insurance for? That's off to me, That's it doesn't make any sense. So I left. Um, and I called like a doctor's office, but they said they wouldn't be able to get me in until Thursday. And so I'm really just sitting here like, what? And like, I have things to do this week. Like I do, I have plans that I've been planning this week. So it's just like, I don't, I don't like this at all and like, I can feel it whenever I turn, like, it's just right here. The whole thing just, it feels like I have an infection. Um, but that may just be my Google MD talking. And I'm just trying to figure out, like, can I even wait till Thursday for this? Anyway, I'm at, I, I'm... Whenever I'm down or overwhelmed or stressed, you know the comfort is food. So I wanna get crumble cookies cause I've been wanting to try crumble cookies forever. And I wanna be in good spirits, but also they change their flavors every week. So I, don't, I can't afford, this is a cool car. Let me see if I can show you. It's kinda icy. Yeah, so. It just, it hurts. I might, I might try the Minute Clinic by CVS. Either way, what was I saying? Yeah, Crumble, cookie, crumble Cookies changes their flavors every week. And I wanted to really try the flavors with Jamima last week, but they're just, I just, I don't know. I don't know, I just, I'm everywhere. But I think I'm gonna try them since the Care Now is like really close to a Crumble Cookie. So I feel like I need to take advantage of that. I know I look a mess, but like I couldn't even, I couldn't even make myself the least bit presentable because I'm in pain. Like, be fucking for real. You want me to charge? You want me to pay one hundred and eighty dollars when that's what I pay for my insurance a month? Like that's unbelievable to me. That's unbelievable to me.
got me excited. They look and smell so good. Now, I don't, let's see if I can take this. Oh yeah. Um, yeah, I um. My friend said if you like soft, falling off the bone cookies, you'll like this. I tend to go for. I think these cookies are still mad warm. This one is cake batter. This one is cake batter. Oh snap. Um, oh man. Cake batter is a trifecta of cake batter goodness, including a swirl of cake batter cream cheese frosting and mini cake batter balls. That is fire. It tastes like, it tastes really good. It tastes like a confetti cookie with buttercream icing or cream cheese icing. It's really good. And so the next one I'm gonna try is the Dolce de Leche, a, beautiful, a beautifully spiced cinnamon cookie smothered in layers of creamy Dolce de Leche caramel and frosting. So this one is not warm, this one is cold. It would taste better warm. For sure, it would taste better warm. The next one I got was the maple oatmeal. Like a warm bowl of oatmeal, a soft cinnamon maple cookie topped with maple glaze and a, sprink a sprinkle of oat streusel. Oh, this one is warm. No complaints. That was delicious too. It tastes just like a, a big ass oatmeal cookie. Oh, good. And then I, the last one I got was a Buckeye Brownie, a decadent treat with layers of chocolate brownie, peanut butter, and a smothering of melted semi sweet chocolate. So this one, this one looks warm and chocolatey. Um. Hmm. Mm. 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 Woo! 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 <laughs> Man. That one is chocolatey, peanut buttery. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So I think my top would be, would definitely be this one first, the cake batter cookie. It is good. Mmm, 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 mmm. It is very good. I think they're in order, really. The Dolce de Leche cookie is good. It's just cold, so I will warm this up. Then the maple cookie, or the oatmeal cookie, it tastes just like an oatmeal. This cake batter one is fire. I may go back and just get this one. Mmm. Mmm. Four cookies cost about $15.50, $15.50. So I'm guessing it's like $3.50 a cookie. Would I get it again? Absolutely. I would definitely try different flavors because that's that cake batter threw me for a loop. Very good. And they have flavor. 
These are good cookies. I've heard so many mixed reviews about Crumble that I really didn't know what to expect, but I mean, I'm impressed. And, but I will say like, these cookies is, they cook in. These some big ass, sugary ass cookies, soft ass cookies. So just be mindful of that when you get them. They mountains, but I think they were worth it. I really, really do. I mean, I I waste my money on a lot of other shit. So this ain't, if anything, this is one of the more reasonable things I don't I don't know spent my money on. Yeah, see? Yeah, I mean, they look good. They're aesthetically pleasing for sure. I didn't care about that chocolate one. My God. Hello, hola, what's really going on? It is Friday. Um, I haven't really been vlogging because I haven't been feeling good this week, but um, I am about to go out to a place called Lexi's. We are celebrating the moms in our lives, the young moms, our friends, um, before Mother's Day, because I know they're gonna be busy. So we are going to dinner and karaoke. So uh, I'm super excited about that. I am running late. What's new? So I did want to just come on here. I look kind of good. I did want to come on here saying I'm recycling the ponytail because I was in a rush and it's Friday after work. I usually don't like going to um, going out on Fridays after work because I be tired. My titties look so good. Yeah, I be tired, so I don't usually like going out. But um, because I'm going out on Friday, I had to put the ponytail on instead of a wig because the ponytail is quick, it's easy, and I know I always look good in it. Yes, I'm, uh, our colors are pink and orange. <sighs> I am rushing because I'm late. But our colors are pink and orange. Um, I did get an outfit from Red Dolls, but the top didn't fit. This is from Red Dolls. It's like a kimono sleeve. It's pink. Uh, if I have enough time, I'll show you the outfit after I get back. Oh, my God. I need to put my watch on. My new watch. I'm so glad. I'm so glad I didn't forget. Um, but, yeah, so... I, I, I'm, I need to be heading out now. I'm going to be putting on this watch. Um, yeah. It don't really tell time. <laughs> but uh, it does what it needs to do. You know what I mean? It's a little piece of jewelry and it matches my earrings. Yeah, so uh, I'm going to take my camera with me. Hopefully I can get some good footage. If not, suck my... I mean, you know, I'm just enjoying the time. But yes, bye. The traffic was so bad. What in the world? Me too. Yeah, me too. And like it was just 
acting is ridiculous. I got I'm ballet. Really? I'm I'm proud of me. Yeah, I'm hella proud. Thank you. As far as you're coming from? Y'all, it is so cute in here. It's so cute. I'm like, okay. It's a really girly spot. Really girly. I think that's what she said, pink. Yeah. Or no, no, no. It's she didn't want to blend too much. Oh. Mm -hmm. But I mean, I feel like everybody's gonna be wearing pink. Yeah, but anyway, yeah. No, I, you don't got a pop of pink. You just got orange. I know that's right. Oh yeah, toes. Period. Period. <laughs> I'm sweating because I was late than a bitch. I was trying to get here early as hell. But, ooh. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. you butterfly. I know that's right. I mean, you're cute. Uh, ooh, okay. Greasy. Um, no, I'm just late. <laughs> You know, I got a hoe. No, you look good. You glowing, bitch. Um, she was going to, uh, Kathleen was to go uh, wash her hands. She did her makeup. She did her makeup in the car. Mm. But they said they about to see us. If you ladies would like to come with me. There we go. Boom. Thank you. Yeah. Did you valet too? Yeah, I was down there. Oh, perfect. I don't care where you sit, girl. You know, I'm, I'm just trying to get a video. Did you free text you? Yeah, but I, I worked last night, so I saw it. This is a Mother's Day dinner and none of the mothers are here. I'm screaming. It's really cute in here though. It's like really cute in here. Look at this. It's really girly. It's so girly. What's your name? I know, honey. You better pay attention to details, I like that. Twenty dollars. What about drink? Oh yeah. You talking about high tea? That's why he trying to rip me off. Yeah. Is it aesthetically pleasing? <laughs> you have my bag. Let me go ahead and get it. Yes. <laughs> he said yes. I see your camera, so go ahead and go and get. Yeah, go ahead and get it. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I can't do tequila. On oh, Cinco de Mayo, you can't do tequila. Is that that? Like, I saw him do like, ah! right in the car. And he had like the big spinner. Yeah, you saw, you saw it go down. Yeah. Uh -huh. Ooh, ooh. Oh, that look like blood. Come on, Blade. <laughs> Oh, okay. Okay. Is it hot? No, it's not. It just look hot? So it's going to be dry ice. It's going to give it a smoky aroma. Uh, okay, Nathan. Thank you. Hold on. Can you give me? Can you give me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hungry. I got the rigatoni yeah. pasta with shrimp and steak. Can I have the, the Lexi spicy rigatoni pasta as well? Can I have steak with it? Uh, medium right. I got high tea, y'all. Oh, nigga, I take they THC. I'm so sorry. Oh. I, I got too what? comfortable. CBD. Oh. I'm sorry, Nathan. I, I I got THC in my system. Crazy. Did you drink before you came here? No, I be. You know what I'm saying? You, you know always ask me that. No, I, this, no yes, I you do. This is like it. Yes, this is like your third time asking me if I'm if I drink before I came because I be saying some crazy shit. It's not about crazy, that you know uh, what it is. You know what it is. 
your energy is like immaculate. And I'm like, yeah, I'd be girl, dead so, I'm, stone you know cold sober. You know what it is? Your energy. Hi. Hello. How you doing? Uh, we are ordering right now. If yes. you wanted to take, if you wanted to take a look at the menu, because they said tacos. Oh, because they said that we only have the table till 8:20. Yeah. Okay, give me, give me, give me. Okay, you ready? Oh no, no, no. Finish your sentence. Oh, you know I why? Saying, I was saying it because like you come in with the appropriate energy where people are like oh, hi, and then they sit there and then they rise to it. Okay. You come in with the energy that needs to be there. Why are you putting it all the way up here though? <laughs> And it makes me happy. The way you greeted me over there, I felt important. <laughs> <laughs> you look good. You over there downplaying. I don't have anything to wear. No, did I, I didn't know what I was going to wear. And then I opened it. Please. I took up the tag today. Period. <laughs> Period. Are you ready? Hold on. <laughs> okay, ready? Hi, T. One, two, three. Uh -uh. Oh. <laughs> I look. Oh, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Isn't that cute? Yeah. <laughs> okay, let me do a cute one. Let me okay, look at okay. you. Don't okay, say yeah. that. Yeah, I say that. Oh. Okay. okay. Yeah, look at me. At the placement. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Now is the Valentino showing? Okay. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> okay. 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 Ready? One. Yeah, the filter went a little bit like do do do, but I don't think you can really tell. Oh, that, that first part is cute. Yeah, we that. can we can uh, cut it. Yeah, cut it, yeah. cut it, cut it, cut it. Thank you. Look at the Valentino right there. Oh, period. Oh, I didn't even see that small detail. Thank you. <laughs> you know, I've been doing my implants. Yeah, yeah. Okay, hold on. Let me text you these two. Airdrop it to me. Come on. Oh, yeah. Duh. Okay. 20, 21st century. Yeah. And then, after. and then, no, I was gonna say I was gonna post. Oh, it. am I in your? Mm -hmm. There I go. Look at the picture I have for you. Oh yes, the one you took. Um, it's not good. Is that you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> she said, "Yeah, it is." It's Tova, my mommy. Uh, this is her. What is it called? Her oh, you told me. Yeah, you told me. She gave it to you. No, uh, she found it on QVC again, and she ordered a set for me. This smells good. Yeah, that would be crazy if she like had a bottle that lasted that long. I don't know how people do that. Yeah, I know. You know how they My pass shit. it down to their kids? Yeah, mm -hmm. I don't know how they do that. When it's an heirloom, no, yeah. I don't even. Mm -mm. I run through. Yeah, I run through. I run through. When, I, when I tell you, I spray like it's Bath and Body Works. Yeah. I think you were tweeting about it one time, and I was like, I wonder how if she's like me and runs through them. Like run, you do. What? Run through them like a whole ambition that. And I feel like, ooh. I feel like last year. This you, is dry ice. It's, it's not, not tea at all. It's tequila, right? It has CBD in it. I could have got it yeah, with the pepper. Tequila. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that crazy? It has I'm tequila sure. and. Um, sure. It's at the. Where did he it's take the, it? He took, it's he at took the, the paper. There it goes. Look at it. Is that so cool? Yeah, it's it's. Dry ice. No, no. <laughs> Nathan. Not Thomas. Thomas. <laughs> I should have got it with a different It's fire. Bucket. Yeah, you should have. I didn't think about it. Yeah, it's good. It wasn't. No, no it's dry ice. ice. Ooh, we tweet. Yeah. <laughs> it's normal. It's normal. Yeah. She said, so it's cold. Yeah. She said, it's dry ice. Oh, okay. so, it's, so, so, so it's, it's cold. cold. It reminded me it of was like, giving, It was given. Oh, hi, T. I just got it. Yeah, CBD. I, I was thinking high because I thought it was going to be high. Oh, and like no. it's giving Bridgerton. I think and yes, then when, Bridgerton, it, when yes. he said uh, dry ice, I said, oh, I get it. <laughs> and CBD. CBD. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, I get I it. I get it. I was going to tell you something. I don't remember. So oh, she was, she was giving me, she was giving me like, um, what is that show where they're sitting there in the yellow background? Genius, genius. Genius, the interviews, they'll, they'll sing their song and they'll describe it. Oh, yes. She was giving me the thing, was like, I like to make music that like means something. Yeah. And then she was like, <laughs> who was that? Who was the artist? Who was the artist? I, I forgot. No, like and it was horrible lyrics. Was, was it Ice Spice? No, I forgot. no, no. I forgot. It was another Ice Spice, though. I'm so glad to see 
I'm so lucky. Me to too. See you. And you look so good. Thank you. How the boys? Yeah. Yeah, go ahead just a second. I'll be right back. I'll see y'all later. Uh-uh. I just think you look good like this. I have the steak and shrimp. Yeah, that's me. Oh, it's a steak and shrimp. For her. That's me. You said steak and shrimp? Oh, chicken and shrimp. Oh, no, not chicken and shrimp. I didn't get you. Who got chicken and shrimp? Who had one? Chicken and shrimp, rigatoni? Did you get chicken and shrimp? Oh, that's me. Why are you looking at it like that? Oh, get it out of the picture. Oh yeah, move that there. Thank you. Look at me. Rachel, sit on the chair. I have the Mediterranean pasta. And I find out it always comes with salmon. It automatically comes with salmon. It automatically comes with salmon. Move the chair. But what if someone... is allergic. Do we do the vegetarian option? I didn't know until like that. It's going to be something new, but if you want... It's not that tasty. It's not that tasty? No. I'm sorry. No. Can we pray? Thank uh. you, King. No, I'm not. Definitely not worth $39. Mm -hmm. The tacos were good. Is that lemonade? You want lemonade? What you want lemonade for? I'm How thirsty. do I go with your meal? <laughs> <laughs> if you want to be a bitch, be a bitch on your own time. I'm genuinely asking a question. I don't know, I'm craving lemonade. This is al dente for real. I'm not a fan. I'm gonna eat it. But I'm gonna eat it. Is he gonna bring the pepper in there? I think we need a little I'm salt. hungry. Come on, oh, yeah. It made it way better for me. Well, not way better, but. A little better. Uh, Deb, you want some? I need the food in my stomach. La 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 la. Ooh. Hi, T. Beauty and the peace. If we didn't have a deadline, <laughs> he's he, I, immediately, as soon as we sat down, hey, you guys. 820. Out. <laughs> So cute. Like the, and then it comes out and it's the cut. That, that really did it for me. So cute. No, one more Beautiful, beautiful. Yes. Yes. Happy Mother's Day. That is so, that is so cute. You can't see it, but it's so nice. <laughs> no, she's there by her camera. Happy Mother's Day, baby. So Happy Mother's Day to the mothers all around Happy the world. Day. Just trying to make it through. Happy, <laughs> Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers all around the world. Thank you. Happy Mother's Day to the mommy, to the, to the margarita mommy, mommy, to the mommy. Uh, shake it, 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 shake
Come on, 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 come Da, 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 da. At the Tom Dizzle. Getting some Alki. This is a bougie ass Tom Dom. I got mine. I got what I needed. I got what I needed, but it's nice in here. I guess when you shop downtown, this is pretty. Look. <laughs> Y'all, I'm so hot. Yes. It's been a long day. It's been a long day. It's been work. A work. It's Friday, girl. Yes, 6 30. Trying to rush traffic. Oh my god. Who are we? Who are we? Grown ups. My makeup is melting off. I know that's right. Sorry, guys. I did leave my glasses in here. They just left. The waitress has just left. They put your the cups and stuff. Oh well, none of my business. Right. And I'm about to sweat the rest of I love it behind me. I feel a little thing. I love it behind me. I feel a little thing. Ever since I left the city
it on the New Year's Day. I know when I have a place. I know it's a good thing. Ever since I left the city, you, 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 you and me, we just don't get along. You make me feel like I did your own. High-ass voice! Shut up! Like that we need my love Call me on my cell phone Late night when you need my love I know in the hell I live For long Why you always just grow? You saw her stay at home Be a good girl, you was in the phone You always be a child Right now you're so mad
got enough titty showing. I just want a picture. Uh, 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 all right, closer. Can you not mess up my pose? Uh, ready? Cause we are sisters. We stand together. We lay that hundred families. We know that this set us apart. making all that damn noise. Bye, Kai. See y'all later. Bye, Thank you. Bye. Thank you. He said he loved the pink. It's always very, very humbling to come back to your crib after, after it's been in disarray. You made it in disarray. And you're humble because I was rushing I was rushing. And then 6.30 is traffic time. It's traffic. Everything's congested. Like, look at my table, bro. <laughs> look at it. It's okay. You know, I mean, are you really just, are you really getting ready? Are you really doing what you need to do if you don't leave your place in a rush, in a mess? You feel me? But y'all, I had such a good time. Like, I, I hate. I told y'all I don't like going out on Fridays. But this was just, I was just really just happy. Like, genuinely just happy. Like, the girls, the girls that get it, get it. And I am to the bone. I am a girl's girl. Like. I am a fan of women. I think women are beautiful. I think women are resilient. I think women are just simply fantastic. And I will rally and root and holler for the women from infinity to infinity. And I know, like I keep telling y'all, cause you know, I feel like my personality is very big, very strong that, you know, people tend to focus on the positive, but I, as somebody who's on a self-awareness journey, I know how difficult I am as a human being. I know that I'm rude. I know that my irritation, my tolerance is very, very low. Ask my sister, my little sister, ask my friends, like I get irritated quick. I'm just, and I'm rude, you know, I'm brash, I'm, you know, abrasive. And so like when, I'm with my friends, with with my friends like this, like, it just, it kind of makes me feel really, not kind of, it makes me feel really, really good. Like, y'all really genuinely fuck with me, and I can be myself around you guys. And, you know, y'all make me learn, y'all help me learn to be more kind and more patient and just more self-aware. And also, just have fun, you know, just let loose. It's just, it feels good to go out with no judgment because you know who you riding out with. You riding out with some real motherfucking niggas. You know what I mean? Anyway, I was melting all day. It Summer is here. Summer is here, ladies. So if you're a melter like me, you're a sweater, just... <laughs> Am I an article of clothing? But if you sweat like I sweat, it's time to layer. I'm talking about powder, setting, powder, setting, set, powder, set, uh, I said powder, setting. Boom, 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 Figure it out. Because it's hot. What did Nelly say? It's getting, it's hot. Anyway, I'm going to clean up a little. Well, I'm not going to clean up a little bit. I'm just going to straighten up my desk. Um, take off my... I, I'm, I'm actually going to take a shower. I'm going to shower this off. I'm just going to lay and watch TikTok and laugh until I sleep. Until I go to sleep. I have this, like, lump on my side. I need to go to the doctor. Because I went to the doctor on Thursday for it. And she said it's nothing. But, you know... Whenever they say it's nothing, you feel something, I automatically go to race. Automatically. But I just had a good night. I just had a good night. Dinner. Everything's just, I it was solid. I was surrounded by people that I fuck with. You know what I'm saying? Everybody I fuck with, I fuck with. And um, I just had a good time. See y'all tomorrow.
Hello. Today is Saturday. It is 1.41 p.m. May 6th. I have been moving at the speed of snail this whole day, doing nothing. It's crazy to me. Let me just preface this by saying that I'm lazy, right? I mean, being a big bitch for so long, of course, I may have some lazy tendencies. So during the, during the week, Monday through Friday, I tend to limit my social uh, meter because I don't like going out during the week. Unless I just simply don't have any time during the weekend and I really want to see you. But I don't like going out during the week. Um, and mentally, I am tabbed out after work. And, you know, there's this stereotype around when you work from home, you're, not, you're doing less work and things of that nature. And that may be true. Definitely true for some people. But for me, it's mentally taxing and exhausting. And after 5 p.m., I don't want to deal with people in a social... I barely want to deal with people in a social setting. I, I, I just don't. So, but I do try to get my errands done during the week. So during the week, I do work and then try to do my errands and hopefully start to incorporate some type of physical exercise. And then during the weekend, I try to um, make sure that I'm utilizing the most time I have to see friends and uh, clean and relax and do things of that nature. So this weekend, I have back-to-back -back shit. And also, summer is here, so it's hot. So it's hot, I wear wigs, and I sweat. Do you see, do you see my issue? Do you see the problem with foot, you know? So I'm just moving slow as hell. And it's a it's a solid day. It's a solid day. So, I mean, now that I'm out, I'm going to make the most of it. I know y'all tired of seeing me with this beanie. So, I said beanie. <laughs> I wear it out so much, I'm trying to give it an outside name. If you really just want to see me in something different, give me something different. You know what I mean? Get me something different. Let me showcase myself. And I know a lot of you, especially new subscribers, are probably like, she wears bonnets in the heat of the day in public outside? And do. And do. Sometimes I'm really just brawless out here. Brawless, bonnetful, sweatful just minding my business. I believe that being big, people are already trying not to look at you. It's just a hard truth. They try to get out of your way. Um, they just, they mind their business. So that's number one. I use that for my advantage. You don't like looking at me? I don't like y'all. That's number one. Number two, when I dress up, because I do everything real big, whether it's my makeup, my hair, my clothes, it's double looking. So I have either up or down. And when I'm down, I'm really down. I'm really, really down. So I like to be incognito. It's like hiding in, in, in public. It's like hiding in plain sight, you know? That's just me. Because everything about me very loud, very... So I try to I try to balance it out. And I'm lazy. What did I preface this by saying? Anyway, I really just I gotta gotta damn. I really just wanted to come in here and let y'all know that I'm gonna go get boba. I've had it, I like it. I thought that everything came with I might get two because I want something creamy. I thought everything came it with the tapioca balls, not knowing that I could sub those out, and I'm really excited. And being that it's hot, it's a refreshing drink, so I'm gonna get it. And then I'm gonna go get tacos. And then it takes me five out to five thousand five hundred twenty-five thousand six hundred minutes to get ready. So I'm just gonna lay a little. The dinner's at eight. 
and it's like 30 minutes away from me, so I gotta leave the house by 7.30, but I have a feeling that that's not gonna happen. So I'm just gonna try my best. I'm just gonna try my best. Finish. Whatever happens, happens. Yesterday, the girls were saying I could sing. When people boost me like that, I know like I have a level. I'm not no, you know, uh, Ariana. Why well, I say Ariana first? Am I anti-black? I'm not no Beyonce or Jasmine Sullivan or Ari Lennox, you know? But I do got a little, I got a me, 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 me. I got a little note to me. La, 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 la. And so somebody that doesn't hang out with me as much, so I know it was an unbiased opinion. She was like, and we did karaoke. She was like, you can sing. I said, Stop. I said, you capping? She said, looked me dead in my face and said, I never cap. I know that's right, Queen. I'm like you. Can I get to the game? Sweet yes. Show me the way. Cause I've got bills to pay. Sing it with me. Can I get to the game? Sweet, yeah, show me the way, cause I've got bills to pay. I don't know why I'm lollygagging. I really don't. Like I don't got shit to do. I know those cams were meant for me. Not to sound like a cheap bastard, but like whenever I go into establishes, establishments nowadays, like whenever I check out or, you know, swipe my card, it always asks for like a tip and it always uh, manually sets to 15%. And I'm just like, we do, we tip people just for taking our order? Cause all you did is take my order. You asked me what I wanted. I told you, you put it in. And then you asked me to pay. Am I being a cheap bitch? Because I'm like, for what? Tell me. Tell me now. Because I know the service industry is in the gutter. Especially since the pandemic hit. I know they're overworked and underpaid. I know. But me too. Me too. Anyway, I got me a large strawberry pineapple lemonade with popping boba this this does this look like this is why is it why is it foamy why is it foamy and then this is large it cost me 621 and then i think the most satisfying thing about getting you yeah, see my how my thing just went that way i think the most satisfying thing about getting boba is popping the top in my opinion so we fill up, huh? Ooh. It's good. It's good. It ain't no Calypso or nothing. They need to start make, making Calypso boba. They need to sell that to somebody. There's nothing to brag home about.
I could find a better drink at Sonic. But I did want the popping balls in my mouth. All right. Now that I'm disappointed, let me go get my tacos and eat. I'm hungry. I'll see y'all guys. I'll see you guys when I'm getting ready. Bye. Well, it's Sunday. And it's gloomy inside. Mm. Well, it's Sunday. And I'm a clean up my path. Mm. Mm. Well. I'm gonna get me some groceries Even, even though I'd rather be a mm -hmm. I'm gonna get me some groceries mm -hmm. So I can cook me a steak. Mm. Well, I'm gonna clean. Mm. I'm gonna clean in bed. Mm. Because it's Sunday and what you do is rest with hey, it's Sunday <laughs> Why am I making it sound like somebody done passed? <laughs> Well, it's Sunday, uh, and I'm going to get me a bag. Well, oh, I'm going to read a book, take a bath, feed my fish. It's like I lied. I ain't got no damn fit. If I do, I'm gonna cook it. It's Sunday. I changed it up for y'all. I didn't put on a bonnet today. I put on my scarf. It's Sunday. Um, what did we leave off? Yes, I left off getting boba and tacos, saying that I was gonna get ready to go to a steakhouse last night. I checked my account and I lied. I lied. There's no way I can go out to eat three times in one weekend and I only get paid once a month. If I was to de if I was to determine anything else, I would be determined I would be a fool if I did it. Yes, I want to celebrate friends, but also I want to be able to not be broke by the end of the month. And unfortunately, that means I have to make sacrifices. Either that or I have to find another gig. And I simply can't do that. I simply can't get another gig and then focus on YouTube as well as have my main job. It's just, what did Whitney say? Impossible. Things are happening every day. But not that. Not that. You got me fucked up. I'm not going to do that. Um... I'm never going to stop talking about inflation. Inflation is insane. Inflation makes you believe that you have to cut back so much that you can't enjoy the small things. And it's it's insane to me. I hate it. I hate it. And then, you know, with the job market being the way it is and inflation happening and the layoffs and the strikes, it's just a scary time to live in to where I don't want to jeopardize anything I have going, you know? But... With that being said, it's Sunday. And so I'm just going to do some errands real quick. You know I'm a treadle. 
I the trader jewels, I the trader who trader who trader jewels, I the trader who in the trader jewels, I the trader in the trader in the trader who, I the trader winning trader winning trader who, I'm gonna give me the 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 trader who, I'm gonna I eat inside food, you know? So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do some inside. I hope I'm going the right way because I'm seeing a lot of nice shit. No, I don't remember. I remember seeing nice shit. Um, I knew I knew in my heart of hearts, like, my mind was gonna change because I simply don't got it. And, you know, as humbling as it is to tell myself that I don't got it, it's also very eye-awakening, eye-opening, you know? You just have to tell yourself the truth sometimes. And the truth about the matter is, okay, I am going the right way. I had to be show because I was on show. The truth of the matter is I just can't do it all. Not right now. But you know, I, I think that this is just a temporary uh, setting for me right now. I'm building things right now. I'm praying for things right now. I'm willing things right now. I watched The Night Agent yesterday. I watched it through and through from episode one all the way to episode 10. And... There was a quote in there that said, you deserve everything you say you deserve. So, and then on Twitter, I saw something that said, when I realized worrying was a type of manifestation as well, I stopped doing that. And I think that shit is so true. Like when you worry, when you worry about things, you bring things into existence, you know? So I'm trying, and I, and I told y'all from, from the beginning, I'm trying to rework, rework my mind from stop being so negative. But I think I'm, I've been in a place for so long, almost my entire life where everything that happens to me, that's good. I always set it off with, well, bitch, you still this, you still that, you still this. And it always negates the positivity in my life. And I deserve that because I'm not changing my mindset. I'm not executing things. And I'm tired of that. As y'all know, I say it so much. So, you know, just being cognizant of the words I speak on myself and what I deserve, because, you know, as much as things are needed, as much as lessons are needed, like, I'm ready to elevate and level up. But even though I think that I'm ready, am I really ready? You know? Like, let's be honest with ourselves. And so, while I get ready, because you want to be ready, so you never have to get ready, um, I'll focus on definitely adding more positivity into my life. It's hard to do, though. It's hard to do when... You've been tongue lashing yourself. Oh, you've been whipping yourself verbally all your life, you know? But yeah, I guess. Anyway, I'm just gonna go to Walmart, get some things really quick, and um, cook something because I'm hungry. I'm hungry. I wanna read a book. I wanna read a book today. I'm tired of scrolling. I'm scrolling, I'm scrolling my whole life away. I look up from scrolling and an hour has passed, two hours has passed. Like, get a grip. You have to, and the thing about it is I have things to do. I have things that I can do. But instead of doing the things that I need to do and can do, I'm scrolling, wasting my life away, wasting time. I see these guys on the road. You don't want me to go? Foolish. And you're looking at me, dummy. I'm a trader, tra 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 trader, just. I think I'm at the age now where I want to keep like gum or mints in my bag because I don't want to be in somebody's face and um, my breath stinks. And I think that we are in a day and an age where you know when you stink. Full stop. You know, on Twitter... There's a lot of, there's always a hygiene conversation going on. Do you wear, do you wear a bra more than once before you wash it? How many times do you shower a day? Uh, when you shower, how many rags do you use? This, that, and the third. I'm not discussing how I utilize my hygiene and what I do in my crib on the internet. Fuck you. I don't give a damn. I know you know when you stink. Like, I know, I know, I know when I musty. Like, when I, <laughs> I know, I know. When I have my mouth closed for too long and I open that hoe up, I know. I, 
I'm just being honest. I know. So I don't want to be around people. And I haven't even attempted to try to mask that in any capacity. Me personally. And one thing is, like, I don't want to be, because I'm loud. I'm rambunctious. I don't want to be talking and somebody be like, God damn. You talk all that shit and your breath smell like shit. Do something about that. You know? So I'm going to be more mindful to try to get mints or gum just to keep it in my bag. Also, I don't know if y'all know about Tate's, but Tate's are uh, these slim, crispy cookies. They're very good, but they're expensive. They used to be like four something. Now they're $6. It's, um, it's unbelievable. However, they just came out with, uh, well, I just saw these salted caramel chocolate chip. And another thing that y'all need to know about me, salted caramel is a hit for me. It's a 10-10 every time for me. I am... I am a salted caramel fan. If there's only one salted caramel fan, I'm the one. If there's no salted caramel fans, just know I left this earth type shit. Like, I am a car salted caramel fan, especially when it comes to desserts. Like, pazookies, cookies, brownies, downies, slownies, or mounties. It don't matter. Any ease that you want to put on it, I'm with it. So, I just, I just did a really quick... Uh, Walmart thing. I wasn't even supposed to get those cookies. I really just came for deodorant and baking powder because my sink, my, the sink stinks. And so I saw online that baking powder or baking soda, boiling water and vinegar might clean that hoe up and it needs to be clean because what is that about? Um, but I will say I be I be utilizing that um, garbage disposal for less. If the water just leaves too slow, I turn that hoe on. So um, now I'm finna just go to Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's, the one by my crib, it don't have the brioche bread that I like. So I'm gonna have to travel a little further. I don't mind though. I ain't never been to this Trader Joe's. It's a little bougie for me. I don't want nobody saying no shit. Like, I don't, I don't like the way it look. I really don't. But we gonna keep it moving. One of the few times, I only got one bag proud of me and it was just some things that i had to uh just to re-up on some bread some veggies and i spent 26.73 that bread is four dollars that's crazy but i'm gonna get it every time and is but I'm hungry now. I got beef and broccoli, so I may make that, but I may wait for dinner for that. And then just make what I want to make right now, right now. This is not my side of town, okay? It really is not. So I'm about to skedaddle. School out. Mm.